Welcome back to Miles Around. This is our second in the driver's seat, and it's the 2007 Chevrolet Corvette Convertible. Now, this vehicle is a pure American emotional drive. Right, Dennis? That's right. I grew up on Chevrolets, everything from 409 Impalas to small little Chevy Deuces with 283s. If there is one car in the world that is absolutely 100% Americana, it is the Chevrolet Corvette. Now, back in the 50s, a group of core engineers at Chevrolet were designated with creating an American sports car. Six generations later, you have what you see behind me, the C6 Corvette convertible. Now, we're going to take a peek inside. Actually has a trunk, but for now, let's take a look under the hood. Now we have the hood open of the 2007 Chevrolet Corvette convertible. You can see it has the LS2 engine, and that's a big piece of American iron, right? You better believe it. Now, they can call it six liters if they want. I'm going to call it 364 cubic inches. I don't know where the liters came in. So long ago, it was always about cubic inches. Now, this motor has 400 horsepower and 400 pounds-feet of torque, just a sliver under the last incarnation of the Z06. Now, the performance in this car is not only revolutionary, but it's also new for the Corvette in general. A paddle-shifted automatic transmission is something that, I don't know if it looks out of place, but it functions very well. When you're talking about the visceral feel of performance in this car, it is everything that you want. Open air excitement, big horsepower, that big car, sports car feel that only the Corvette can deliver. You know, back in the 50s, there was a core group of engineers from Chevrolet that were designated to design America's sports car. Six incarnations later, the C6 you see behind me has made it all come to to the head that we see today. It is truly a piece of American performance. There isn't enough time in a half an hour show to talk about all the styling cues on the C6 that come from all the previous generation Corvettes. Everything from the slice in the hood to the fender flare that comes over the wheel opening. I mean, everything about it is quintessential Corvette. Look at these really great vents down here on the low, long, wide slung doors. Nice, flat, big trunk. And of course, the electronic roof is the best thing to happen to this car, well, since it was conceived. There's one place you truly want to be in a Chevrolet Corvette convertible, and that's in the driver's seat. I could talk about the selective ride. I could talk about the new navigation system with an incredible audio system, all the new gauges, personable to everything you could ever possibly imagine to make your own. And that's truly what the ownership of a Corvette is about. I could talk about all the things that come down to what is the experience, but it's this. When you're in the driver's seat, you're out, you're on the road and wind in your hair, there's few cars out there that can give you this kind of experience. Now, when you add in all the electronics that make it easy to live with, easy to drive in traffic, easy to drive on the highway, it just makes it that much better. The only thing wrong with this car is the fact that I don't have one. So we've taken a look at the Corvette from all different angles, and now I'm going to ask you, Dennis, for your two ups and one down. However, try and keep it under five minutes. I'll try to do my best, Nick. You know, it's everything that is Americana. I've said it once, I'll say it again. It's power, it's handling, it's the feel, it's everything that you get when in the hair. American style. The Chevrolet Corvette is that quintessential car that gives you everything that a six-figure European sports car can give you for well under that. $67,000 is still obtainable by the normal Joe. Not everybody, but still well under a hundred grand. My other up is the technology that's in the car. The all-aluminum block, the magnetic ride, everything about this car truly does take another step for Chevrolet's technology. Now my down is tough to narrow down to one thing. It's a bunch of little things that, to me, maybe make the Corvette unobtainable. I said it once, I'll say it again. The car is great, but they should have a stripped down version that's somewhere around about 50 grand. Let me tell you my two ups for this vehicle. My first up is the ride. Now I have to say, I took this car over multiple amounts of railway tracks and it handles like something with so much bigger suspension, almost a luxury town car. It's soft, you don't feel the bumps. My second up for this vehicle is well, it's the automatic transmission. Now, you might find that funny in this sort of car, but I'll tell you, this automatic transmission in a sports car is probably one of the best I've ever seen. It handles really well, and it still allows you to spin the tires out. My downside for this car is what it did to my social life. I have a lot more friends now that I don't necessarily need, and also everybody's complaining that they can't go to the store with me. <laughs> The 
2007 Chevrolet Corvette convertible comes standard with the LS2 6 liter 400 horsepower V8 and standard 6 speed manual transmission. The base price is $52,510 with an as tested price of $67,860. The city EPA ratings for miles per gallon is 17, while the highway miles per gallon EPA rating is 27. Here are the guys that make miles around possible. The Russ Auto Group, Baxter Auto Parts, Northside Ford, Ray Reese Dealerships, Four Wheel Parts Performance Center, Grand Prix Imports, and Jay Lee's Auto Group. Thanks, guys.